The Turkish Navy's first ever offshore patrol vessel, OPV, the Hizar class project's lead ship was spotted at the Istanbul Naval Shipyard. The future TCG Akisar, P-1220, is ready for launch. Amre Kore Jenksoy, the Naval Program's director of ASFOT, the main contractor of the project, shared the photos of the future TCG Akisar and stated that the ship is ready for the launch ceremony. Only 15 months after the steel cutting, TCG Akisar, with most of its equipment fitted and its power system ready, awaits the launching ceremony. The steel cutting ceremony of the OPV took place on August 15, 2021, and a scale model of the ship was first exhibited at the IDEF 2021 Expo in Istanbul between August 17 and 21, 2021. In April 2022, the Turkish Ministry of Defense announced that block construction of the lead vessel of the class, the future TCG Akisar, has begun at the Istanbul Naval Shipyard. Under the Offshore Patrol Vessel Project, initiated to meet the needs of the Turkish Naval Forces, the construction of 10 vessels is planned. The first ship is scheduled to be launched in 2023. Developed as a variant of the Milgam-class corvettes, the Hizar-class OPV has been redesigned with a different main propulsion system and a different structural and general layout concept, allowing it to be built in a shorter time and at a lower cost. The primary missions of the OPVs to be built are Intelligence, Surveillance, and Reconnaissance ISR, Search and Rescue SAR, Counterterrorism, Maritime Interdiction Operations MIO, and Maritime Special Operations. Other missions include Naval Air Operations, Electronic and Acoustic Warfare, Land Bombardment, Defense Against Asymmetric Threats, Maritime Traffic Protection, and Support and Training for Amphibious Operations. The Hizar class OPV is being built using the fitted for but not with concept, which allows for the integration of newly developed indigenous weapon and sensor systems. The OPV, which can accommodate a total of 104 people, will have a range of 4,500 nautical miles with its Codelod combined diesel electric or diesel main propulsion system. The rendering shared by Asphod indicates a heavily armed ship compared to average OPVs. According to the rendering, the OPVs will be equipped with anti-ship missiles, likely Atmica or Chakur, a 2 times 4 vertical launch system to launch surface-to-air missiles, probably Hizar family air defense missiles, a Gokdenas close-in weapon system, CIWS, a 76M gun, and a small missile launcher, likely to launch laser-guided El Umtas missiles. Considering the Turkish Ministry of Defense's announcement marking the commencement of the construction of the OPV which indicated a fitted but not with design approach, it's unclear whether the above weapons will be installed on the first ship, as officials didn't provide specifics on the armament and sensor equipment of the OPVs.